I recently picked up some solar lights to jazz up my yard for the holiday season. There were some mixed reviews online, so I figured I would test them out and share my results. Stand up. Stand up. Stand up. Be careful now. Whoa. Right, we'll go like this. The first thing I did was get my outdoor lighting consultant to help make the job easier. No, no, no. Hold on. You got a job. We then removed the housings and switch. flipped all the switches on the lights to the on position. You yes. got it. Light, you see the light? Pretty simple stuff. That way we know it's gonna work good. The reviews online told me that most people had issues with the batteries. These lights work on a rechargeable battery and some may not be fully charged. To make sure this would not be an issue for me, I set them up underneath the light and let them juice up for about eight hours. Grab on. Walk straight back. I took them out the next Keep day, going. and with the help of my consultant, we Keep measured up the space way. and got ready to put them in the ground. Now, quick going. note here. Keep You're going to need to remember that these are solar lights, and they have to be placed in an area that gets direct sunlight during the day. Otherwise, the battery will not recharge. Oh, stop! Ready? The next thing you have to do is reverse the stake at the bottom of the pole, and then you're ready to push them into the ground. If the soil is tough where you're going to do it, you should use a trowel. I probably wouldn't use a hammer. You may break the light. And that is it. I had no problems at all, and my lights worked well. Now only if my consultant was awake to see his work.